Well, as Niger continues to grapple with the challenges posed by hypertension, medical practitioners in, have uh, been advised uh, to look for the cheapest means of avoiding the disease through an increased provision of health screening and making certain tests and investigations uh, mandatory for the populace. The Chief Medical Director of LASITS, uh, Professor Akin Tokumbo, who uh, uh, gave this advice during his Goodwill message at the 24th Scientific Conference and now no General Meeting of the Niger Hypertension Society, NHS, held in Lagos. Also speaking, Professor Akin Abayomi, the Commissioner for Health, Lagos State, who emphasized the commitment of the Lagos State Government to a sustainable health care delivery, particularly for chronic diseases like hypertension and diabetes, I lighted alarming statistics suggesting that more than 30% of adults in Nigeria suffer from hypertension, commonly known as high blood pressure. It is clear that the Lagos State Government, through the Ministry of Health, is about to establish a drug management agency to help contain the cost and promote local production of generic drugs for metabolic diseases, thereby stabilizing the cost of medication. <laughs> non selective top level of Let's talk about I And I what I've talked about, what I've suggested. The one of the ways to increase uh average of um Recently we have heard that Mr. Governor signed the executive order. Domesticating the National Health Insurance Authority Act of 2022, which makes every citizen of Nigeria and now every citizen of Lagos mandatory that you possess a social health insurance scheme as a must. The consequence of that, the consequence of that is that you will have access to the minimum service package, which includes metabolic diseases, and particularly diabetes and hypertension. And we will also give you access to your medication free of charge as long as you enroll on a scheme that includes a social health insurance component. It is that out of necessity, our government this act in ensuring the affordability of medication for these chronic and other diseases in this country. And there is also a need to encourage the manufacturing of critical generic medications particularly for hypertension, but also for other diseases. The Royal Father of the Day is Royal Majesty of Baolushegun Ogunye, the Ojotumaru Abigi Ijabu Kingdom Ogun Waterside. Look, government encouraged the participants to take the campaign to the grassroots and schools at large. There are problems at the grassroots. People don't even understand that hypertension is a killer disease. They may probably they be hearing about hepatitis, they be hearing about um, malaria, but we are talking about something that will just trigger their blood pressure to 270 over 190, and all they will tell you is that they will go and get one or two leaves, squeeze it, and probably that's it. And that is why we have a lot of death casualties and so on at the grassroots. So it's actually bad. It is terrible. The awareness, they should let people know at the grassroots that hypertension is real and that it is nothing they could manage at home, that they should go and see their doctor. The rate of hypertension in Nigeria is rising. Um, as of now, one out of every three adults in Nigeria have hypertension. What we can do to curtail this rise and this will include things like if you take diet for example reduce consumption of excess salt and the simplest way to do this is after food has been cooked let's not say oh this salt is not enough we want to add more the 
second method of doing this is not to take food that is preserved with salt. There are certain food that you need salt to, to preserve. Oh, it's a day conference thing. Management of hypertension in a depressed economy and sub that thing hypertension in children, the past, present, and future, and the health financing of hypertension and hypertension related diseases are in attendance. Some medical experts from all over the country. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.